the last video we talked about how uh, machine learning has too much of competition on uh, the supply side as compared when we compare it with the mon stack which is the main stack for uh, web development now uh, in today's video what we would be discussing about would be uh, we would be actually doing a live demo on linkedin jobs and in the last video we uh, made the rhs side which is the demand side we made that constant but today we are considering the supply side to be constant which we which we know that it is not but in the last video i proved that it is uh, if we consider the compounding factor in mind then it is around 6 to 7 times much uh, greater now in this video we would be uh, considering the the job side which is the demand side okay so uh, this is linkedin jobs and uh, what i do is i'll first go to the search bar yeah this is the jobs platform and over here i'll have uh let's say we have machine learning okay machine learning jobs i'm not talking about engineer data processing everything i've considered in one in one step even it is included uh, including human resources and digital analytics and stuff like that right so when we see over here as you can see if i uh, just scroll then if i uh, zoom then you can see it is showing in india machine learning jobs are currently open machine learning jobs and i'm talking about currently open jobs and not talking about you know on an average but we can uh, you know do a proper test for this as well considering three weeks and just uh, like today is uh, what today is 2nd october then I'm, i can take one on 12th october and then on 22 october but uh, and then you know normalize it but but uh, not uh, going that much into the deep analysis uh, if you want me to do so you can just uh, put that in comments and i would be glad to do that as well but uh, just taking a random uh, reading then today we have uh, 9075 jobs open in the machine learning side and you have seen the competition right so uh, there is no doubt in that now uh, let me uh, let me just uh, do it javascript okay so taking a generalized term for uh, web development as well because javascript is the main 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 stack right i'm not uh, uh, okay in this i'm not going into django i'm not going into flask and i'm not going into uh, other languages as well so for back end as well you have go rust and all of these languages i'm not going into that uh, i'm just uh, talking about this so javascript jobs in india are 51000 So you see the you see the demand side, right? It's fifty thousand, and that was what nine thousand. So supply side of machine learning is six th six times, and demand side of JavaScript is six times, um, right? So you can see, and this is I'm keeping all the biases aside. I'm keeping uh, like I'm not normalizing it. I'm not I'm taking a random reading, you know. So. that's it and uh, so you have seen the javascript jobs versus machine learning jobs and see uh, some people on my last video commented that pay scale of machine learning engineers is much greater than uh, you know web developers see it's it's not like that it's india it's india everyone is underpaid right so if you are even if you are machine learning developer then also your pay starts from uh, what your pay starts from uh, from 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 2 to 4 lakhs and then it goes up to you know what 30 40 60 lakhs as well and even if you are if you are in google doing have you have done phd and you are working on front line then you get 60 to 70 lakh packages right it's it's it's, it's normal and even if you are uh, um, a javascript developer then also your pay starts from 2 to 4 lakhs and then it goes to uh 60 70 and 80 lakhs so it's it's not like it's not like that and if, even if you want then we can have a glass door review quick glassdoor check of uh, of these things if if glassdoor glassdoor actually uh, wants me to you know make an account so let me just glassdoor machine learning uh machine learning engineer something okay so it's what 114 one, uh, 114000 okay and let's check for javascript but it's uh, it's showing me in dollars so there can be differences uh Not in India. Let me do a class to check. Um, it shows me seventy six in US. It's talking about US. Uh, I'm not talking about US. I'm talking about India. 
so let me just change it and let me just do it machine learning not pages on instagram machine learning job no not job machine learning engineer salary in india uh, and i will go by the class door this is the trusted one so let's see uh, we start from what 58000 25000 you can see the uh, the variation is something similar and let me in a new tab open javascript dev salary uh, javascript dev salary class to okay uh not not this one on the normal one javascript developer salary in india okay so as you can see over here as well it's something similar only and let's let's see okay it's showing me using linkedin salary i want linkedin salary i want class to okay this is class to Cool enough. It is showing me machine learning salary on average. It is seven seven lakh sixty five thousand. So seven uh, lakh package or eight lakh. You can you can round it off to eight lakh. Okay, and uh, and over here as well you have seven lakh eight lakh. Okay, so so packages are same. It's it's not that machine learning engineers are paid very much. Uh, JavaScript are paid too low. It's not like that. And even uh, the the salary is. See the salary is uh, kind of moderated by uh, the uh, supply demand game only. You can take the you can take the uh, example of onion prices. So when uh, normally you have what twenty rupees per kg or thirty rupees per kg per per half kg or six forty rupees per kg uh, onion, but uh, when all of this uh, you know did uh, all of this. Uh, which table holding thing comes in when people start collecting onions and you know the 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 supply the supply side just uh, goes you know vacant just goes null and the demand side is always constant right it's always on the high then the prices rise so here as well in javascript the supply side uh, supply side is currently very low but the demand side is huge it's it's really huge you can see over here 51000 right Fifty-one thousand five hundred seventy-one results we have got for JavaScript in India, and there are various stacks, React, Node, and all of that. So, so you can see, right? Um, so, yeah, that's all for this video, guys. I just wanted to compare the supply side, the demand side as well. Um, in if you want me to compare any other thing, you know, Android versus machine learning, or Android versus web, or anything like that, just comment it down. I would be glad to, uh, you know, respond to that and make a video out of that. So. um that's all for this video guys if you have uh, liked the content then please hit that like button subscribe to the channel and uh, comment if you have any doubt or if you have any sort of uh, confession to uh, be made then uh, that's all thank you